In this video, we will be replacing our old air conditioner that is on top of our RV. So as you can already tell, we've already started removing the air conditioner. Of course, we got a little bit of cleanup work to do, but basically we're just gonna unwire it, pull the bolts off, lift the air conditioner off the roof, clean it up and put the new one on. And the new one is a Holton made by Rec Pro. Now these are really cool because A, they are a heat pump and they are also extremely quiet unlike a regular air conditioner that you would have in your RV. Installing the new air conditioner is really simple. There is a ring that sits on top. It's something similar to this. You have to seal it between the roof and the ring. Then you sit the top of the air conditioner on that ring you come down inside the RV and then you have this bottom ring that gets bolted to the top ring in the air conditioner. The bolts on mine were not long enough so I just used some all thread and I used a coupler and put them together and it was not a big deal for me. They do sell an extension kit at Rec Pro that allows you to get longer bolts and the tube that came with this was not long enough. I just cut it in half and then I extended it using some of that bubble foil wrap. It's fine. It will work okay. After you have those bolts tightened up, the bottom shroud just snaps in place but then you need to take some screws and put in each corner. The snaps just temporarily hold it so it doesn't fall down so you can tighten those screws up. And then you just snap the filter in place and you're ready to turn it on and see if it works. The one thing everybody likes about these air conditioners and sometimes it's the primary reason they are buying these is they are extremely quiet. This is on high right now. I'm talking at a normal voice and you can hear me just fine because it is that quiet. Because this air conditioner is a heat pump, you get a couple of extra options and I really like these. First of all, you have your standard cooling then you have a dehumidifier. so if you just want to dehumidify the inside of the RV, you can definitely do that. There is just a recirculate where you can just control the fan. Then there is a heat mode because it's a heat pump, you have heat and you can get quite a bit of heat out of this as opposed to a heat strip. And on the bottom of the air conditioner, when you're looking straight up, you can see what the temperature is set to. So we have it set to 68 degrees. There's also a remote holder, so you can put your remote on the wall or anywhere out of the way so you don't lose it. And overall, I am extremely happy with this air conditioner. In fact, I'm probably going to buy a second one for the rear of the coach. If you like these types of videos, don't forget to like and subscribe. Take a look at some of my other videos. At the very least, you might be entertained.